Hello, welcome to Joyful Angel Oracle. I am Angelia Joy. Thank you for joining me. The choices for the individualized oracle offering. Smile, smile, smile. Oftentimes it's not what in particular you're doing, but how you are doing it. And this is where we allow who we are, the aspect of the divine to reflect into what is so that those around us have that much more to experience. We are calling the Enchanted Map Oracle as offered by Colette Baron reed as well as asking for supporting messages through the wisdom of the hidden realms also offered through Colette Baron reed At this time, I'll open with the invocation. You can, if you'd like, set your intention and focus your awareness. I ask the divine energy of love that permeates the universe and bonds all in one to guide each of us seeking into the highest truth we are ready and willing to understand. And so it is. Okay. Yes, thank you. And for the wisdom of the hidden realms, I ask the divine energy of love that permeates the universe and the bonds all in one to guide each of us seeking into the highest truth we are ready and willing to understand. And so it is. Thank you. We'll begin here with smile. <laughs> Number 38. In reverse. Heal the ouch. Forgiveness is the healer of the soul. Colette has recorded. <coughs> This card is a message urging you to make amends for any harm you've done to another. Appraise yourself honestly. How have you been selfish, greedy, or inconsiderate of others? Have you harbored resentment towards those who have harmed you in the past? Practice deep and radical forgiveness. In order to be free, to know healing, you must surrender old hurts and begin anew. Forgiving yourself and loving yourself is important too. Be humble and willing to admit to your weaknesses. Know the imperfections of the human personality. Walk tall. As you take the path of the shaman, the wise elder who is willing to go into the shadows to bring healing light to old wounds. The wisdom of the hidden realms offers number 38 in reverse as challenger, keeper of the scales in fairness and balance. As challenger Colette has offered, 
Events are turning your life upside down and you may be dizzy and confused. Are you feeling that life is unfair for you right now? Do you believe others are getting ahead and leaving you behind? Could your ego be throwing things off? Your pride and self-centeredness may be weighing down the scales. Another message could pertain to the behavior of others throwing your life out of whack. Are you around drama that causes you to become ungrounded or caught up in it? The keeper of the scales says it's time to take a break. Do whatever is necessary to bring yourself back into balance. Let go of all people behaviors, or conditions that bring you into disharmony. You will be very grateful when balance is restored and you're off the roller coaster. Remember that what goes around comes around. Justice will be served one way or another, and harmony will be restored. As we move to smile, the enchanted map brings us number 25, metamorphosis. You are in the process of deep and beautiful change. Butterflies earn their wings through great effort. The process of change is often painful for it is never without losses and sacrifices. If you are to transform from one form to another, a part of you needs to die. Letting go isn't easy, especially when you're used to thinking a certain way about your life and how you live it. Just as a snake sheds its dead skin or a caterpillar dies so that a butterfly can be born. You're required to release your old ideas and embrace a necessary change so you can live your best life. Perhaps you're being asked to let go of low self-worth, a dream that no longer serves you, a relationship that is draining, or unhealthy habits. Despite your fear, you must accept that this is a transformational time for you. There will be some loss involved, but you'll love what you become. And then support the wisdom of the hidden realms. <sighs> Brings number 35, the Lady of lightning surprises sometimes shock total paradigm shift as an ally the lady of lightning brings powerful forces of change into your life she tells you to expect a sudden shift in your circumstances perhaps a situation you weren't anticipating arises and offers you the opportunity of a lifetime or a series of aha moments culminates into a pivotal flash of insight causing everything to change just like that. Maybe someone enters your life and pushes you to new heights. You may have a brilliant idea that hits you like lightning. Be prepared change is imminent and a total paradigm shift may be upon you. Don't resist the changes as this kind of lightning isn't something you want to fight. Great things are happening when the Lady of Lightning appears. Thank you. And for smile. The enchanted map asks you 
to clean house. Thank you. It is time to clear the clutter, to make way for better things. When you see the cleaning house card in a reading, it's time to declutter your life, get rid of unwanted things in your physical home, and release what is no longer what you want or truly need. Is there any unfinished business you should address? Thoughts, memories, and emotional baggage must be swept out of your house as well. Your conscience must be clear for you to move freely in the world. Celebrate a spring cleaning and feel the freedom as you make way for much better things. Look at what you've resisted discarding and be honest about its value. Be honest. Clean house. <laughs> Uh, ah. and the wisdom of the hidden realms offers the desert prince number 19 as challenger survival and false promise mm. as challenger colette offers don't be fooled by the beauty of the desert prince now for your being faced with a mirage sometimes you can't see the truth because your thirst for achievement and recognition may blind you to the true nature of your situation perhaps two circumstances prevent you from being able to see with clarity beware when faced with something that seems too perfect miraculous and easy if you think it's too good to be true, it is. Pay attention to false promises at this time. Don't be swayed by shortcuts and flattery. The best way out of this is to accept that every life has a desert period. Just accept this for now and cross it one step at a time. You will be led to green pastures and fresh clean water with divine appropriate timing there is a curious swaying in the scales of balance that is your life your journey is yours but do not give up what looks to be some of the harder work. If you are drawn in that direction, it is to serve you. There is no comparison in the process that each travels through. You know in your heart, twice the cards have asked you today to be honest with yourself. No one else. This is not about anyone else right now. While we all interact and engage on a much broader level, in the end it is what you specifically bring to the dance that matters most for your journey. Seek it out. You know what it is. And join in the dance. You are well. You are loved. And it is a beautiful day to smile, indeed. Thank you for joining me. Be well. <laughs>